The following is an educational special on what not to do when recording. When recording, use the best quality software possible in consideration to what hardware you have. Not everyone has the capability to afford a talented editor and is still recording and editing videos in their spare time. With that out of the way, sit back, relax, and enjoy the program. Hello folks, this is the Gamer Nerd, and this recording is running at roughly 60 frames a second. We have some occasional drops to 59 or 57, but it's mostly 60 frames per second. Now, for this episode of Progress Bar 95, you are going to notice a major improvement for, um, for episode 9. This is going to be the first 60 frames per second episode that we do for Progress Bar 95. And believe you and me, this is going to be awesome. Yep, that was me. I made a pretty bold claim there. But was I able to back it up? Well, if we skip past the usual, usable footage, I mean the footage that we were able to grab without the OBS tanking heavily, you'll start to see a very, 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 very apparent problem. Recording uh, with OBS at 60 frames per second was just not feasible enough for my computer. And this will be apparent when we get to the DOS prompt of the, of the footage. And you're, you're not just going to see freezing there. Oh no. OBS froze frames a lot when recording this footage. That's what went wrong. And beyond that, well, needless to say, it was really not my best work. But I bet you wonder if this is the worst footage you've ever seen. Well, let's get straight to the DOS prompt, shall we? Oh, yeah. There was a red thing and a green thing right next to each other. You know what happens when I hit the green thing? Yep, you guess if you guess blue screen, you would have been absolutely right because believe me, I've had that on way too many a game of Project so far. One of the challenges is to actually catch one of the segments. Which is really weird. Right. 
Ooh, it's ping pong ball. That's all I'd like to have. Thank you, calculator. I'm surprised I even had a good math ability. Come on. Paper? I think I'm doing pretty good here. And how far have we come? An hour. Hmm. I think I got time for another game. Nobody likes you. Oh. oh. How did I miss the green one? Better not lose all my save data. All right. Oh, really? No, go away. No one likes you, Cookie. Got a 40 gigabyte RAM. And then it'll be well before I can install Progress Bar 10. Okay. So yeah. Hope these little, those little highlights from episode 9 helped you out. And on the positive side, I believe I made a, an episode that was accessible, accessible to blind people because, well, the video's technically more audio than video because of how much the video freezes. Anyway, the main takeaway from what I what I just showed you is this. When using OBS, never record at a higher frame rate than your computer is capable of. This is especially apparent when it comes to the graphics card. I was originally going to make this as a lead-in to episode 10, but having it be its own separate video is especially helpful as it gives people a guide on what not to do when it comes to recording video using OBS. Not just using OBS, but recording video in general. Now if my face is a little washed out, maybe the lights are too bright. But 
Also, I've learned some other things from doing video editing as well. There are certain elements of, of the video that are beyond your control. Like lighting, for instance. Like, you can't control the brightness of the lighting if your switch doesn't allow for it. Yeah, I know this all too well. Anyways, stay tuned for episode 10 of Progress Bar 95. And I will see you guys next time. Peace out, everyone. The preceding has been an educational special on what not to do when recording. When recording, use the best quality software possible in consideration of what hardware you have. Not everyone has the capability to record a talented editor and is still recording and editing videos in their spare time. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe if you found this video helpful, and if you want to be notified, please hit the bell. With that said, have a nice day. If you have any tips of your own for recording, feel free to leave a comment to contribute. This video is brought to you by Progress 495, the game that takes place in a virtual operating system.